push down the back, hinge, push through the heel, up, hinge from the hips, lower using my glutes and hamstring again. So 10 on the right. And then switch sides. So the only time I'm going to take my foot off that step is to switch from the right foot to the left. You're going to balance on one foot. Jump laterally as far as you can. Balance. Or with the core board. Balance again and leap. Side to side. You want you to really push back with those hips. Lengthening through the hamstrings. Push, 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 push. And then come up. And you don't have to go much lower than your knees. I've got some pretty good hamstring flexibility and just about parallel, really is as far as I need to go. I like to hold my dumbbells on my shoulders. It makes it easier to keep my chest upright. I like to put it in front. So it's just jumping over the top. How hard can it be? Spread those legs out, hence the name spread them. 40 reps. Lunge into the next one. And that's why I call them lunges. So I squat, up, and back, up, back. All right. All the way up, and all the way down. Chest up, shoulders down and back, giant step forward as you walk forward. All it is is squat, jump as far as you can. All right, so perpendicular to the ground, and then you just go parallel, touch, and then right back up. Lifting with my right leg. My left hand is on my waist. Careful that you're not leaning or counterbalancing with the torso. After you've done one side, switch and do the other. And that's it.